Ace Money the name, getting paid by the game. My goal is to help you get that money by sharing my picks as well as some useful knowledge and betting techniques. Now, while we go over this recap, I'd like to get right into these picks so we can get in and out like a BNE with handicappers. So, what's the SBR Sportsbook Robbery? What's going on? I'm Ace Money, and this is Sportsbook Robbery. We got on uh, December 3rd, NBA. Uh, big slate, uh, in season tournament. I think there's 11 games. Start at 7. Some still got something to play for. Others just playing the play. I uh, do have a few play props. Only went through the first couple games. Found a decent amount. Uh, I'll hit the 10 o'clock games later. Let's get right into it. Uh, it's been a cash cow. Uh, points over 13 and a half. I'll wind it down a little bit. Uh, I think they got him at 14 and a half. He's, uh, he's bounced around the last couple of years. Last year he was on Milwaukee. So it's kind of like, I'm not going to say a grudge game, but players go against the X team. Uh, he's coming off the bench, which he don't mind. Uh, plenty of threes. He might go over three and a half. That's what his number's at, plus money for threes. Uh, safest play would be his points. Uh, don't play crazy minutes, just bench minutes. You know, bench scoring. Bring it down to the last five. Four out of the last five. Uh, averaging about 28 minutes, 54 from the field, 44 from three. Average of four threes. Shoots mostly threes. He'll throw up a couple, a couple twos. Uh, exceeded 13 and a half, 12 of his last 13 games, averaging 19. Milwaukee's 15th in points allowed, 22nd in shooting guard. Beasley and Beasley. All right, next up, Cade Cunningham. Uh, I like his rebounds and assists. You play him separate, put him in together. Kind of ends at 14 and a half. I think he's going to go over both of them. I figure put them together in case one's more than the other. Uh, starting point guard. Points are always a good play, too. Probably even do PRA, but I just figured I'll do this rebounds and assist. As you see, these last, what, 12, 13 games, easily cleared this for the last 10. 10 in a row. He's the point guard. Uh, Milwaukee overall ranked 24th. Rebounds, 10th to assist. 25th and 14 to the uh, point guard position. Last 10 games, he's averaging 17. Uh, he could go for his double double. As you see, he's getting at least 10 assists. But uh, I like this one, Pierre. Uh, PNA. RNA, sorry. RNA. Potential assist, averaging 17. Rebound chances. Averaging 13, definitely varies, but uh, he's exceeded 14 and a half in 11 straight games, averaging 18 and a half. Key Cunningham, let's get it. Uh, head to head, what do you do head to head? Played once this year, he had 18, seven rebounds, 11 assists. All right, Dame Lillard. Uh, rebounds over three and a half. Point guard, but he'll be getting some boards. He'll get crazy amounts, but I'll get a couple. Uh, various discrepancies, even on the same books. Uh, go over this all the time. It'll say, it'll say rebounds. It'll either have the guy's name, and then rebounds, it'll be one number. Then they'll have four plus rebounds, have a bunch of names, uh, stuff like that. So just make sure you... You look around, get
get the best number. Uh, 135, best on FanDuel. For the year, yeah, we're on the year. 81% hit rate, 13 to 16. Averaging four, you don't get much over it, but I get over it. Uh, Detroit rebounds allowed, rank eighth to the point guard. They are ranked fourth. Uh, head to head. It's cleared this a few times. Uh, none of them are this year. I thought this last one was this year. I still think you should go over it. There's five games, averaging five. Plenty of minutes. Uh, mostly defensive, but occasionally he'll grab an offensive board. Uh, he's exceeded three and a half in eight of his last nine, averaging a little over four. Uh, should be able to get it. Not worried. Game time. Garland, three is over two and a half. Nice right, so 125, handle uh, 135, 145. Playing Washington, uh, Cleveland's going to be at home. Overall, Washington's ranked 26, threes allowed to the point guard, ranked 24th. It's got a 55% hit rate, 11 and 20, averaging three for the year. Head to head. Played once this year. He had, uh, I think, four. He had four. Plenty of minutes. Shooting 46% for the year. Uh, a little over six attempts, averaging three. No insight. No insight. Yeah, I think you should go over it. Playing at home, you know, uh, they're going to pull away from Washington, obviously. But uh should be an easy go. And uh, Jordan Poole assists over four and a half. Mine is 140. Vandal, Jeff Kings, uh, if you can get bet MGM, it's 135. Clear this three, six, seven out of his last eight. Uh, Cleveland overall ranked 14th to the shooting guard, ranked 27th to assists allowed. 63% uh, hit rate for the year. More so these last couple weeks. Uh, he's exceeded four and a half, seven of his last eight games, averaging just about six. Uh, 31 minutes a game. Uh, potential assists have been up there. Usually you want to cut these numbers in half. So going back these last eight, nine games, it looks good. But, uh... Yeah, he should get it. He's a bowler. Uh, I like his steals, too. I've been playing his steals here and there. Uh, I didn't play it today. Uh, but, you know, let's get it. Jordan Poole. Uh, Philly at Charlotte. Charlotte's at home, obviously. Uh, 7 p.m. I've been playing this, too. Uh, over one and a half threes. Minus 130. Uh, best odds, uh, big discrepancies once again, minus 150, 60, 170, all the way up to minus 190. Uh, Philly does have a decent uh, three-point defense, sixth overall, shooting guard ranks seventh. But uh, shooter's going to shoot. It's cleared the eight out of 18. Uh, he should be in the starting lineup. He's normally not a starter. Got a couple people out. They uh been working him around. Uh no Embiid either on the sixes. But uh his minutes been going up. He's 
33% from the year. You see these last couple of games, he's been putting up a lot of shots. Uh, threes for that matter. For last game, he made three the game before. Uh, we were cashing him all these days over here. Uh, he started missing. I laid off him. You know, cost us. I think I might have bet on both of them games, actually. But uh, it's time to get him again. Let's get it, Josh Green. Square Garden, 730. Uh, over one and a half threes. Highly juiced. Plus 170. Not juiced. Uh, plus money. Plus 170. Now, plus money plays like this. Always bet a little less. Uh, we've cashed them all these days. They had it like, went down to like 130, 140. Uh, didn't miss it here and there. Haven't bet it in a couple of days. He hit it again last game. Uh, real good percentage. He's up there even in his regular field goal. He's getting around 12 points a game. Uh, 33% from threes. He don't shoot too many. Let me break it down smaller. Uh, his percentage went down from these three games. But he still don't shoot many. He only shoot three or four of them, if that. Uh, he may not shoot till second, third quarter. But he's playing at home. Uh, I think it's going to be a competitive game. He's going to go over this. I believe so. Uh, plus money play, like I said, I always bet less. Uh, Orlando, good, good defense for threes. Shooting guard ranks seventh. But, uh, he puts up a couple. You know, four if we're lucky. Uh, he's going to get two of them. Let's get it, Josh Hart. This next gem, if you could just hit that like button, new viewers, let's subscribe, turn on your notifications. This way, you get all my plays, my live bets, anything I do. I just try to keep you informed. Uh, you got any extra time? Just leave a comment, likes, and comments, help get the videos out there. I appreciate everyone who does. All right, listen, my, this is like easy money right here. This number is at three and a half, play it. Um, Hartenstein. He used to be a New Yorker. New York couldn't afford to keep him. They weren't allowed to pay him what he should have got paid. So, uh, you know, after we trained him, he, he went and got paid. Uh, he's doing real good at OKC. He was out most of the year with, with a broken hand. He just came back. Uh, he's played five games. Five games, he's went over this. Three and a half first quarter points. Now, just be careful. First quarter points, uh, you know, first quarter anything is, is tough. But uh, we've been cashing it last year. I cashed it 50, 60 times. Um, and he wasn't scoring like he is this year, not as much at least. Overall, 26 points allowed to the center position, ranked 29th in playing Utah. So, uh, yeah, it should be an easy cash. He don't go much over it, but he'll get over it. Uh, might be one putback, and then it might be uh, two foul shots. He's a good foul shot shooter. Um, another play, you can play his points, but they're kind of getting the hang of it. They keep raising it up a little. He went, uh, I think he scored 17 last game. 19. Uh you know, anywhere around the 10, 12 mark is good. Um, this game could get away from them, uh, from the Jazz at least. So we'll see what happens. But definitely in that first quarter. Another play for him, double-double. Uh, the odds are good. Jump on it. He's going to get the rebound. He's going to get 10, 12, 14, 16 rebounds a game. A uh, bunch of assists, but uh, double double. There you get some positive EV on here. Outlier right now. They're doing a, a Monday, 
you get a <clears throat> free week at a pro if you're a member already. But uh, he's had a double double every single five games he played this year. He's had five double doubles, uh, rebounds that is, rebounds and points. If I could play two plays, I would play that Beasley, and um, I'll play this Hartenstein. Maybe the double double instead of the first quarter, but. Uh, you see these are his rebounds, 13, 18, 14, 10, 14. And he's hit 10 points in every game at least. But, uh, yeah, if it was two for Tuesdays and I could only play two plays, it would be Hartenstein and uh, that Beasley. But I'm confident in all these plays as well as I'll have more for later on. Drop them in the community. Hit that subscribe button. Appreciate everyone. Need some money to name, getting paid for the game. Let's go.